Blind imitation is bad. In a dinosaur school in the forest, younger ones from all dino families would come together to learn, starting from the ferocious T-Rex to the calm and peace-loving vegetarian Diplodocus. All dinosaurs would coexist in the school, never fighting or hunting one another. One day, the teachers asked each of them to tell others what made him different and special. One after the other, the dinosaurs got up and revealed their special qualities. Then, a Spinosaurus, Spiky, got up and told everyone how he could live in water and on land. Then he dived into the river nearby to show everyone some stunts. Impressed, some dinosaurs jumped in to imitate Spiky, but not all could swim, and soon they struggled to stay afloat. Panic-stricken, the teachers rescued all their pupils and then told them, never blindly imitate someone, always use better judgment before taking the leap. Hoping for the best Once a dinosaur, Sue, was roaming around the forest looking for food. Suddenly, she saw a T-Rex sharpening her nails and teeth with a piece of rock. Sue looked about carefully but couldn't see any danger for the T-Rex anywhere. Despite being so clever, she couldn't understand why the T-Rex was doing that. Unable to control the urge to ask, she went up to the dinosaur and said, You are so strong and powerful that everyone is scared of you. No one dare attack you. You don't even need sharp teeth. One powerful stroke from you is enough to knock someone out. Then why are you sharpening them? The T-Rex replied, Sue, we live in a forest where enemies are everywhere. Who knows when I'll need my sharp teeth and nails? One should always be prepared for the worst and hope for the best. Always speak the truth. One evening, Aki was home alone. To pass time, he went into his parents' room and started looking around for interesting things to play with. Aki found an old pen in his father's closet and proceeded to search for paper to write on. As he attempted to write with the pen, it didn't work. Aki gave it strong jerks, but it still wouldn't work. Then he decided to open the pen to see what was wrong with it. In his attempts to open it up, he accidentally broke it. Aki thought he'd get in trouble, so he hid the pen. Soon, his parents returned. Immediately, Aki went to his father. Crying, he revealed the series of events. His father stroked his head and said, Always speak the truth, no matter how hard it may be. I am proud of you. Results of Evil Once there lived an old dinosaur. She had a huge alarm clock. The alarm clock used to ring loudly and tell her the time. Every morning the alarm clock would ring to wake the old dinosaur up and then she would wake her grandchildren up. The grandchildren got very upset at the alarm clock. Because of that clock, their grandma would wake them up early in the morning. They devised a plan to get rid of the clock. So one day, they completely shattered it. Now Grandma Dinosaur had no sense of time. She would often wake them up in the middle of the night or sometimes forget to wake them up at all, leading to missed meals and confused days. The grandchildren repented their evil actions severely. Thanks for watching. Do like, share, subscribe to Sahil Book House.